The Bentley Greens returned to Kingston Heath on Friday night for round three NPL Victoria action with Pasco Vale. It was a clash of two informed sides with both starting campaigns well, winning their first two games of the season. Paco's Davy Van Skip had the match's first real chance, bringing out a fine save from Ryan Scott in the fifth minute. But 15 minutes later, and up the other end of the pitch, the Greens took the lead through Matt Thurtell. A Webster ball over the top drew Souza off his line, with the Greens striker rounding the keeper before slotting the ball home coolly from a tight angle. The Greens looked like taking a one goal advantage into the break, but three minutes from half time, that lead was doubled. Patsy Muratis showed good awareness to pick out the run of Hicks, who once inside the box, slammed the ball into the back of the net for his second goal of the season. The second half was energetic with plenty of chances on goal, but that tempo was cut short in the 72nd minute when Marko Jankovic was issued a second yellow card to reduce the Greens to 10 men. But John Anastasiadis' side held out for the remaining minutes to secure their third win of the season from as many games. As expected, the result has Bentley at the top of the table with other high flyer Avondale yet to play. But the Greens head coach was realistic about the expectations at this early stage of the campaign. Well, I mean, look, you know, there's people out there saying, you know, oh, you're the favourites now. It's like, look, at the end of the day, it's three games in. There's another 23 games. Anything can happen. So we're not. We're taking week by week, game by game, and uh, you know, we know what we're, we're at. We know what we have to do. Uh, there's no doubt. There's uh, some some big games coming up, and we have to get uh, you know points at our on our ground, especially.